Hello, uh, it's me again and yet another Green Drake fly. This is the done stage of Ephemera gutulata, Eastern Green Drake, as well as can be Ephemera danica in Europe or Vulgata. I use this as an alternative to a dead Green Drake I tied uh, the last time, making this a, a bit bigger, more floating with more and longer hackles. Uh, it have also this floating tail, a very similar fly with uh, this letter Y or let's say V shape wing from uh, Mallard flank. This can be really bigger, it can be 8 to 10. It is the fly which is called the Orvis Eastern Green Drake. So hook 10, some dry fly hook. Uh, in this case, TMCO 100 SPBL and thread uh, again the same, some white 80 thread tie in, and we first go in for wing, make a thread base, almost uh, the wall hook shank, and and where the wing will be, somewhere here. Four wings. Once again, Mallard Bird flank green gray color. So select uh, two or three. I'm going for three here. Three of these flanks in similar shape. And remove the fuzz and remove these side side barbs so we will have just something like this which have a similar length all these barbs so I'm going to do this with all three and Nicely now, even tips of these feathers. Like this. Take this bunch and tie in. Uh, as I said, I'm making here a bit longer, so it will be probably the length of the hook or the hook shank at least. Okay, again, you can try, rise it and see how long they are. I will go for a little shorter, just a little a pinch. Yes, and uh, and cover this, secure this, and cut this in an angle for the smooth body. Cover this as well. And leave here enough space. We will have a lot of heckles, so keep this in mind for about four wraps. So this this is just just alright. And we're going all the way back with the thread. And for these tails, you should use a mousse, uh, a body or a mane, mane hair. Uh, body will be better, but I have just mane now. So take about roughly like 15 of these, put them in the sticker. Take 
take this bunch and tie in and it should be long enough but not so long about the length of the of the fly without the, uh, about the hook shank okay that's that's all right and secure this go with my thread under one wrap cover this more and trim and cover the wall but of this of this tail and now going with the thread you can do this before of course uh, in front of the wing and make a thread dam bulk to rise rise it we're going to need a lot of thread wraps here it's slower rising Okay, now divide this wing into two equal parts. And with a cross thread wraps form this V in an angle about 60 70 degrees. And uh, like three, four wraps is enough here. Okay, um, I'll just cover this. Fine, and um. Uh, For body, I'm using poly body thread, polypropylene, some cream, and for rape, the same. Uh, some brownish can be red brownish. I choose this one. So take a piece of the cream, or first let's go for for the rape. So take a piece of this brown. Polypropylene, polyarm, tie in. Now for cream. Cover this. And we go in with our thread just behind the, these wings. And form the body from the cream yarn. You can use a needle one like when you tie in the salmon flies to spread and make make the body much more smooth. I don't care here that much. Just 
just like this. Leave again space here for vehicles. Uh, I'll trim this. I'll cover this a bit. And let's go for the brown rape. It can be four to five. Okay. Secure this here. Trim it. Now, always using some really green heckles in a combination with the grizzly variant or buried brown grizzly. I'm using this one and I don't have that green, it's almost like forest green, so I'm going for another green grizzly. So tie in first let's go for the, the brown. Tie it in the shiny shiny side of the heckle is facing to your side. And tie in the green one. If you have some forest green Maybe it will be better. Not sure for, for Danica here in Europe, but maybe for the Eastern Green Drake imitation. Just trim. The heckle butt go in with my thread all the way to front just here don't have too conic uh, or straight straight step otherwise the heckle will slide down so you can already build a, a small head here and I first go in for brown I will do a free wraps behind and free in front of these wings secure trim already And I'll go for green, just about two behind and two in front of. Will be fine, should be fine. Don't tie down your wings, be careful on this. One, two, three, maybe A secure. Trim. Take a straw, a piece of straw, put it on thread. Build a head here, cover, cover this. That will be just fine.
refinish. Okay, I will put it once more on the This like, like this I will do another with finish to make the, the head more smooth here. Of course I died tied down some hairs. And it's time for varnish. Time for trim thread. Remove straw. And time for say goodbye. So thanks for watching and bye bye.